Freelancer, welcome to the Bow to Blood Arena. You have been chosen to compete for the mantle of Bow to Blood Champion. In this contest, you will pilot a deadly airship powered by your essence, the very lifeblood that flows through your veins. Your path to victory, your very survival, will depend on your skill, your cunning, and how you choose to wield the power inside you. But you are not on this path alone. Other captains have been chosen as well, but only one can be named champion. Alliances and rivalries will form as you each vie to outlast your competition. The arena will test you, Freelancer, in ways you can't possibly begin to imagine. But for now, let the games begin! Enough talk. Let's get out there and shoot something. Ellie, anyone ever tell you you're kind of intense? Not twice. Let's just get started. Captain, to activate the ship, you'll need to charge it with your essence. All systems online? Captain, you have the con. Be careful where you aim the ship out there. This area is kind of a mess. Cap, I didn't crawl out from under the overseer's boot just to sign up on a ship that gets cut after the first match. But I've heard you're the real deal. Well, so am I, and I'm looking forward to showing you. Wait, is this the part where we tell the captain our life stories? I'll go next. I was born very young. You may not be taking this seriously, but I am. I have to. Oh, Marlo, always so stoic. Really, I get it. It's a deadly blood sport with life-changing stakes. That doesn't mean we can't enjoy ourselves. Oh, well, you're in luck then. Because it looks like the Overseers have some fun planned for us right away out of the starting gate. Good! All this waiting's making me itch. It's time to meet the arena's newest challenger! Ah, there you are, Freelancer. Let's give the audience a better look at you. Please move to the center of the staging grounds. Do you hear that, Freelancer? The crowd's excited. They want to see what you can do. Captain, is it time to man our stations? Just give the order. I call weapons. No, wait, shields. No, I want to be on engines. It's your call, Captain, but both of us Hello. are fully trained on every station. What's up? With me on engines, I can keep things from overheating, giving you the chance to take us to a higher top speed. Let's give the people what they want. Ooh, this is my favorite part. Our cannons will aim wherever you're looking, so set your sights on an enemy target and fire away. Just give you helping out on sensors.
console display to see how much damage we suffered. The blue lines indicate shield strength. The lines on the sides and front of the ship represent armor. They'll change color as our armor takes damage. Looks like our shields were able to absorb the shots from those skiffs. Our armor is still in the green. Keep an eye on our ship's health. If our armor drops below red, we'll start taking hull damage. And if our hull drops to zero, well, that's bad. We'll have to jump out, which will disqualify us for the rest of that match. Well handled, Freelancer. But let's see how you deal with the Overseer's moshy borders. Those borders are too close for our main cannons. Looks like you have to take out your sidearm and deal with them yourself, Captain. Good day. Those mushy borders didn't seem to make much of a dent in your ship, Freelancer. But we've only just begun. This next round's gonna be harder. Let's cheat. Okay, no cheating, but let's at least try out some of our sneakier tricks. Our airship has four charge systems powered by Essence. Each system lets you trigger a different ability using the ship's controls in your hands. Looks like Overshield doesn't have any charges assigned. We can protect ourselves better if you shift one of your Essence charges into our Overshield. Let's mess with it a bit. Pull one of the Essence charges out from a different system and assign it to Overshield. seems to like you too. But you will need to impress the Overseers if you want to survive to the end of the season. You may jump out when ready. Be bold. Fight. Win. Freelancer, amongst your many foes, 
We've hidden a warp key you'll need to find in order to escape. But that's not all. Hidden among the threats is untold treasure. Yours, if you have the will. Stay under the mist for too long. We'll suffocate. Oxygen level is critical. We have to get above this mist or we're done for. I'm picking up some caches on sensors, also enemies. Get on those shields for you. Chest. It's little, but it's something. Nice. What do we get?
bulwark's prow shield is too strong. We've got to get behind it. Looks like the key is straight ahead. Just need to shoot open that container and it's ours. I'm on my way! on those splinter shards. Let's keep it up. What you need? Preparing sensors. Ready, Captain. Yes, Captain? Incoming.
you need. Operating drone. Here to help. The Freelancer, the Asher. Today's event will pit you against one of the Overseer's most terrifying discoveries, the Fiend's Oracle. You can't take it on directly. At least, not until you've lowered its shields by taking out its shield sentries. The challenger who destroys the Fiend's Oracle will be awarded a bounty of points, courtesy of the Overseers. Let's see how you fare. Begin. Strategy, Ellie. We're not doing half bad out there. This guarantees things stay that way. Jumping in the turret? We want to make a dent in this thing. We need to take out those shield drums. Oh, that thing already has like a million lasers. Giving it a shield is just gratuitous. Sensors picking up an elite enemy. At least one, maybe more. Eyes up, Captain. We got borders. Hello. Telling me there's at least one elite baddie around here somewhere. Before the shield down, its devilish hearts exposed. That's funny. I thought we needed to take out those lasers next. I think that's what he meant. Huh. Well, let's get started then. Of course. 
laid bare. But like all predators, it's most dangerous when That's a bit much, don't you think? Seriously. Watch out. It's winding up for something big. That's a big blade. Not the biggest I've ever seen. But easily top ten. Sir, congratulations. You landed the killing blow. You will receive the Overseer's reward. We won. And any minute now, that other challenger is going to be calling us up asking for something. Do we have to share? Welcome, challengers! Now, challengers, let's see what impact that last match had on the race to become champion of the arena. Challengers, look to the current standings. The culling approaches. In the culling, the bottom two challengers will be put to a vote. The challenger who receives the most votes will be eliminated from the competition. It's time to deliver the Overseer's judgment. Who will receive the laurels? The laurels are awarded to the captain who, in victory or defeat, distinguish themselves with courage, honor, nerve, or sheer ambition. Chube Zai receives today's laurels. You will also be awarded a custom personalized airship spray, handcrafted by the mysterious graffiti artist, Drace. An auspicious beginning with our first match complete. Until tomorrow, challengers.
Hey, Ellie, what's with the bandage? Oh, <laughs> had a run in at the watering hole with one of Karnak's boys. Oh, man. Is he okay? He'll live. Probably. Thank you.